Hey there, so in this video I'm going to go over the flow meters. Uh, the controller can support two of them. Um, however, in the future I will have some add-ons available so you can increase the limit to 10. And uh, you can see two of them are on the main screen here. But if we go into settings and we go to our hardware, we can find our flow meters. And here we've got different settings. So these are universal at the top here. So we can view the measurement type in pints, quarts, liters, and gallons, and uh, metric or imperial and then the viewing format and just select how you want it uh, down here we can calibrate uh, the dosing pumps or the flow meters sorry here just adjust the rate so there's two methods if you read that you can see how it works there and we'll go to adjust pulse rate this one isn't so accurate but there's usually a number that comes with your uh, pump or your flow meter and you can just set it there or we can do the better one calculate flow rate so now you're actually pumping water through here and there's instructions how to do it. Um, the volume for calibration, start the timer, it'll start, stop, and now you've calibrated it. So you're basically telling it, I'll go back in here, how much water you're going to pump and then start it and controller will time how long it took and it'll figure out uh, what the flow is actually at. So you can do that. Um, and to control them there are two methods um, actually there's no methods but what you can use them for you can control equipment so if we come into our add new custom rule we've got flow meters here so we can go into our flow meter and here's our rate so we can just adjust it and if it drops below a level greater two or less than you can turn anything on or off so watch the video on custom rules and you'll see how they work and you can set up alerts. Oh, I should have went up here. And if we create an alert, they're also there. So if the flow goes above or below a certain level, you can send an email, beep all the time, a notification, all kinds of things, different volumes. So watch the video on alerts. And one other thing, graphs. So here we can see the flow over time. Uh, I don't have any connected so there's nothing there but you would have the flow rates so which would look similar to this bunch of lines. <laughs> so that's it thanks for watching thumbs up subscribe and have a great day.